Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. Well, you know, n next week we'll have to talk about Atlantic City some more. I, suppose. I don't know. While boaters continue to look for help in keeping the Fox River locks open, those stories are next as News Center 11 tonight continues. Federal funding of the 17 locks on the Fox River between Menasha and De Pere ends this October. When they'll reopen and how they'll be funded are questions still to be answered. News Center 11's Jeff Straw reports there's another lock on the Fox that's in no danger of closing, thanks to a dedicated boat club and a lot of corn. For the Berlin Boat Club, the sweet smell of success is the smell of roasting sweet corn. This weekend was the 34th annual Berlin Boat Club Corn Roast, held yet again to help fund another year of operating their lock near Eureka. That's right, it's their lock. The 55-family boat club leases it from the state at no cost, but it's the boat club that comes up with the $5,000 to run it each year, and it was the boat club that rebuilt the lock in 1976, a job the state said would cost $80,000. The lawyers have told us that we are crazy for doing something of this nature because everything we do belongs to the state. Every cent of money we put in belongs to the state. Uh, we feel that we want something for our people, our uh, children, uh, to uh, have in a, we, as we've had. The Berlin Boat Club is certainly unique. As far as they know, they're the only boat club in the world that sponsors its own lock, but they couldn't do it alone. They said without the support of boaters from around the state, spending money at the corn roast and money going through the lock, this lock would close tomorrow. We'd like to see the lock stay open. It's just like all the other locks. We'd like to see that they stay open too. The Berlin Boat Club is proud of the fact that for about 30 years, they've operated the lock without any state or federal aid. And they think the future of the other 17 better-known locks downstream lies in local involvement, too. Well, I think they could do it if they could get the people to work together. You can't only do it with money. And I think if the people have the drive and the desire, we'd be more than happy to show them what we do to maintain ours. Near Berlin, Jeff Stry, New Center 11 tonight. Up next in sports, Paul Daniel.